Simi by Blockboy JB. James Baker was born in Memphis, Tennessee. He started rapping when he was 14. Around the same time, he joined the Pay to Roll Mafia gang. He started out putting music on his SoundCloud page in 2012. He released his first mixtape, Who I Am, in 2016 and started generating a buzz. He caught the attention of Drake, who featured on his song, Book Alive. Shortly after, he announced his latest mixtape, Simi. Simi is Blockboy JB's seventh mixtape. How do we feel about it? Black Boy JB. Pulling up on your block like Bowser. You know, I had to say it once. <laughs> Pulling up on your block like Bowser, man. His man, Tay Keith, got him into doing music, man. What's up? Dude that produced most of the album. How you feel about Simi from Black Boy JB? You know, after that freestyle, you know, I was expecting something towards what we got and everything like that. And that's what I got. But for 18 tracks, I kind of felt like it was just mostly the same thing, same type of formula. But in his you know, credit, it works for him. But I kind of feel like he could take it farther. Because, like, you know, we get songs like Look It Live, um, I think it was Good Day, Left Hand, uh, Rover 2.0. I thought that he kind of held his own on them, you know. But then we get the tracks like Mama Cita, Wait, Mexico, No Velcro that were just like, just kind of there. Like I didn't really feel like it was nothing. Like it was just like you know, play me a beat and I'm just spit on it. And you know he he has a lot of fun too. You know he um seems like he's just in the booth, just being creative with his words. You know playing, having fun, everything like that. But as far as like, you know, creative wise, I didn't get that much from him. But I do enjoy what he's doing to his, you know, his craft. You know, I think he has an area as well, you know, as we talked before. But I just feel like it was just too much of the same kind of piano beats here. I'm a rap here. One thing he does do that kind of annoys me is like on songs like Rover and Nike Swoosh, like he'll just the song just start without rapping like he'll just start rapping like kind of abruptly just kind of like there's no waiting like he'll just start rapping right away and then the beat will carry on i don't really like that but i guess that's his style but overall i think you know he he has a sound that's enjoyable i can see that a lot of people liking this to turn up to play at parties whatever like that so i give it a c minus i think it's, it's average for this zone of music it's not my particular taste but I can see why a lot of people could gravitate towards the sound because it's the turn up beats, all like that, and that's it. But not particularly for my taste. My taste. I can see why people would like Black Boy JB in this sound. So yeah, that's it. That's it, man. Yo, man, how you doing today, man? I'm straight. Yeah, man, I'm I'm doing pretty good. Cause <laughs> I, I mean, I don't really get much to say about this fucking album. Yeah. There's a couple of things I do want to talk about though. Look alive. I love Drake's verse. Mm -hmm. I love the vibe of the beat, like when Drake's rapping, like that kind of cadence. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That dope. shit was dope. Low pump on none of that. I actually like that verse. I, I forgot to say that too. Yeah. Low pump did his fucking thing. Yeah, Little you pump. You can actually hear what he's yo, saying. Y'all ain't hear him. He Little flow. pump. <laughs> that nigga is trash, and he yo he did he did some shit on there. Like I enjoyed that shit. Yeah. And Rover 2.0, I think I'm starting to enjoy 21 Savage from really? time to time. Okay. Yeah. Like I I caught myself just dying laughing at all the 21 ad libs. Like 21. I, I don't know why like that shit is funny to me now yeah uh yeah no chorus part 11 mm -hmm. for some reason i found this like one of the standouts on there i actually yeah. enjoyed this i thought it was pretty cool is it really part 11 like i didn't take the time to look to see if he I has more parts nah, i didn't check <laughs> i didn't bother check hey let us know pull up pull up on the podcast like bowser and let us know <laughs> if this is really part 11 you know i'm just curious yeah uh and then the outro i thought the outro was dope he had with fun with sample. that outro <laughs> yeah yeah with the outro that was pretty dope yeah now amongst the things that i've noted everything i didn't mention was ass everything i was not feeling any of that shit mm -hmm. his verse on look alive is ass good day ass left hand ass asian bitch was 
ass shoot. How'd you like money bag? Yo, yo, on that. No, I wasn't feeling that like that. It was, did it sound like he was like over a phone or something? Like the way I mean, he was it, mixed. Hey, <laughs> it might, he might have really been on the phone. Like he'd be in trouble with the law. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no fucking telling. But yo, JB, Black Boy JB did not have any of the swag and personality that was on his fucking freestyle from the Double XL cover. Yeah. If you liked his music, that's cool for you. But uh, Tay Keefe, he did do some cool things on production. And mm-hmm. there's a couple other producers on the project. Yeah. But overall, this shit was ass. I'm not clicking on this again. There is great music all over the place. Mm-hmm. I, I don't have to listen to this again. Shout out to J- Bo- JB, Black Boy JB. Hope you get all the money you possibly can out of this rap shit. And I hope the next project is spectacular. Cause it this should shit, be. This shit was not good. I get his joint F. Damn. No. I, it was trash. Whew. And, uh... Yeah, so hey, your I day's guess, going guess, good, I man. I guess I'm the nice one. Any, today, any, huh? any new PlayStation games out? <laughs> you know, anything anything else that we could talk about other than this Black Boy JB album? I mean, shit. Damn. This shit was not good, bro. I, I wasn't feeling it. Hey, I, I said it's not my taste, but I can understand why people might like it. He fits that zone. Yeah. And shout out to all the Black Boy JB fans. <laughs> Yo, you looking for TV reviews, music reviews, movie reviews? Then check out the only reviews that matter, man. Yeah, just hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the notifications and stay tuned.